anyone who wants to do art in this country i always tell them come to delhi cuz you know that's where you'll find the most interesting people electronic music fits there because it's a fast pacey music it kind of balances the rhythm of delhi as a city when i heard about the project i was so excited i'm hinano i'm an artist based in bangkok i think to have a successful collaboration the artist really needs to be open minded my name is jp i'm a music producer dj based in new delhi india and jameson connects are bringing us together to create a brand new song i'm actually not from delhi really where uh, are you from 1200 kilometers from here wow but there was no music scene over there how's delhi is it working in general the music scene is also much more inspiring for me over here it was definitely a very special thing to bring hinano into india and show her like what the arts and cultural space in india look like I had this idea that maybe we can go into this R&B space where we can blend in your vocals and your songwriting. Yeah. I have to think of like a motive. Usually when I make my songs it's always like four chords or sometimes five yeah, or yeah. six. So I've never been to India. I feel like it's really special. It has a lot of details in the art scene and the culture and the food. The way you are as a person, a lot of that translates into the way you are as a musician also. Like your habits, your style, your approach, your attention to details, your workflow. It's more of like opening up your minds to try something and then being honest saying oh i like this i don't like this i think that's really important and then when i went to magfield i got to see him perform on the stage and i was like oh i can see i get it now this chance do i really have the musical abilities will i be able to make music with them